Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a couple of months since I've posted. I apologize. I've just been busy with some things. Um, but I'm back now. And as you guys can see, this is a what's in my bag video. I know in all my other bag videos, you guys are used to seeing the Kipling bag. And I love Kipling, don't get me wrong, but I do own a lot of other bags other than Kipling. And I wanted to show you guys those. I want to give those bags some love too. So for this bag, I'm going to be showing you this Michael Kors large shoulder tote. This is the Raven tote. I bought this from, I think, Zappos. Yeah, I got it on sale. Um, it was under $300, um, good price. I've had this since last year and I love this bag. So starting off, the straps are this nice tan color and the straps on these are very long. This is a shoulder bag and I love shoulder bags, either crossbody or shoulder. And these straps are super comfortable on the shoulder. Even with all the stuff that I carry, it's not uncomfortable. And it's also really comfortable on the crook of your arm. So as far as the comfortability, I totally recommend this bag. Um, let's get to the front. So the front of the bag is white. I like an off-white color. This color is called vanilla. And it has the MK logo. You see the Michael Kors brand down here. It is the metal. And then this pattern is the same all around. Vanilla Michael Kors MK logo. And then on the bottom of the bag, there is feet. So you have the tan color, the feet. So this is a very sturdy bag. And the leather is not a smooth leather. It's more of a pebbled leather and I love pebbled leather because they're a lot more durable and I love um, these kind of materials because it's easy to clean. I've never had any issues with staining or anything getting stuck on it because it's really easy to wipe off. So now let's get into the bag. So the bag has a magnetic closure as you can see. And the magnet is gold. And this is a strong, strong closure. I have no issues with this winging open and things flying out. This is a secure bag. And I've had this for a while. I've used this many times. So, you know, don't worry about the closure. The closure is very secure. And as you can see, as you open up the bag, there is three main compartments. You have two open compartments, and then you have a middle zipper compartment. So in the middle, this is where I would keep my wallet. I keep stuff in here that I don't want to lose, that I don't want slipping out or sliding out. So that's what I keep in and there. So, yep, I have a notebook. You guys seen this before. And then I also have a matching wallet. This is the MK large wristlet, also in the vanilla color with the pebbled leather. This is one of my favorite wallets of all time. I have this in two other colors. I did a video on that as well. But yeah, as for the middle part, that's just what I keep in there. It is super big. I love how big this bag opens, how wide, because it's easy to get in and out. And I could actually put a lot more other stuff in there, but I just have that in there for now. Then we'll go to the right side. So I have tissue, a lot of gum. I have a little red mirror, some lawn comb, and a hand fan. Now, on the right side of the bag, there are six side pockets. 
Okay, and three out of the six aren't even used. You know, I love this bag with all the compartments because I do hold a lot of stuff and it's just, it keeps me organized. So in one of the pockets, I have a flashlight, glass nail file, just in case, you know, emergencies, you never know. I keep a pen here. And then in this pocket, I just keep little stuff. So I have like um, a serenity stick for anxiety, another anxiety stick. I get a lot of anxiety. Some Versace rollerball perfume. This is um, a chill out oil for anxiety as well. And then I have two little Chanel sample perfumes. So whenever I order stuff online from Nordstrom or whatever, and they give these little samples, I always keep these in the purse. These are great to have in your purse because, you know, you just never know. I like to smell good, so I always have perfume and smell good stuff in my bag. Then on this, oops, sorry, the camera's shaking. But on this side, I have a Ziploc with some masks. An extra empty ziplock, some wet ones. I also have some hand cream, sanitizer. And then on this side, I keep all my lip products. So I have some regular chapstick, as you guys can see. Fenty lipstick. Matte lipstick, and this is just a Clinique lip tint. Love lippies. I love a good lip product. So that's what I keep on this side. Oh, and there's two main pockets. You guys saw that. And then there is a back zipper pocket. So this is where I just keep some random stuff. Some band-aids. Some other papers, receipts, movie tickets, I have a rosary, more gum, an eyebrow razor, and a little amethyst stone. And then I keep the card, this is the card to the bag. It is the Raven Large Shoulder Tote in vanilla. Yeah, the original price of this bag was, I think, a little over 300 but I didn't pay that much. I got this on sale on Zappos. But yeah, this is a great bag, you guys. I think this bag has been around for a long time. This is nothing new. Like I said, I bought this bag last year, and I love it. It holds a ton. I'm just going to get my stuff and put it back in here. And as you can see, I have a lot of stuff and there's pockets for everything. And there's still even more pockets for me to use. So I can definitely, you know, stack this bag up. Fill it up, no problems. I do have this bag in the brown as well. So yeah, I like to switch it up, you know. Sometimes I like the lighter color, sometimes I like the darker color. But yeah, as you can see, it holds all my junk. And like I said, there's still room to spare. I could totally put, put more stuff in here. You could put in a drink, a water bottle. You can put some snacks, some food up in here, you know. I usually put charms on the bag, but I forgot to put it on this. But there you guys go. The Michael Kors Large Raven Shoulder Tote in vanilla with the monogram. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I didn't post for a long time. I apologize, but I'm back and I'm going to try to post more often. So please, you know, like, 
comment, subscribe. Let me know what other videos you guys would like to see. Bye.